Back on the field here in Research Stadium following Oregon State's 38-24 loss at home to Boise State. This is the Orange Media Network football recap. My name is Josh Warden, joined by Brian Rathbone and Brendan Slaughter. We'll go quick and just get major takeaways from each of you after this uh, home loss to Boise State going into the Colorado game 1-2. and two. What do you think of this game, Brian? Well, this is another game where we saw Oregon State get down big at half. They were out outgained like 435 to 65 in the first half um, and it's just kind of you know we're 15 games into the Gary Anderson era and we've yet to see Oregon State put a full four quarter game together and I mean these you know second half comebacks you know we saw it last year against in, in the Civil War against Oregon like they're they're nice and everything but I think the biggest takeaway is we need to start seeing Oregon State play for four quarters. It's a big thing Oregon State down big at half now Brendan your major thoughts from this game. Major thoughts is you know I mean it's like Brian said, sure, cool. Even the defense, like, yeah, we played Gar or played well. You know, Gary Anderson was like, yeah, the defense played well in the second half. That's great. You still weren't – you never really threatened Boise. I mean, Boise State probably never felt threatened in this game, to be 100% honest. And you look at it, and like Brian said, not being able to put together a full game, a full four-quarter game, I understand that there are situations where it takes time to rebuild. I mean, look, Colorado's taking it to Oregon today, and it took – really until year four for Colorado to be competitive and win big games. I'm hoping it doesn't take that long for Oregon State, but I think this, more than anything, my biggest takeaway is that we talked about in the KBBR pregame show or postgame show, Josh, the rebuild has still a long way to go. And I think that's the evident thing. A lot of Beaver fans saw how well they played against Minnesota and said, man, maybe this thing's a little quicker. Not so much. I think the Beavers need to get deeper. And, you know, I, honestly, I think Gary Anderson said it best. It falls in the coaching staff again. And you shouldn't be saying things like it falls in the coaching staff in year two. As far as the quarterback situation goes, Daryl Garrettson will be the starting quarterback as long as he's healthy for Colorado. Connor Blunt came in for the entirety of the second half, had a decent game, and Oregon State led, or they outscored Boise State 10 to 0 in the second half. But once Garrettson gets back to 100%, Anderson says he is the starting quarterback. So OC goes and plays in Boulder against Colorado next week. Their next home game will be California two weeks from today. That whole game will be on KBVR Corvallis for the radio call, and you can watch the Orange Media Network. Network previewed then as well. So for Brian Rathbone and Brendan Slaughter signing off from Research Stadium, Josh Warden.